Strings um, basically came out of the old jazz days that we used to do. Paul Goodchild, who was a mate back in those days, said, gee, we could do something up here with the Sydney Symphony players. And so I guess Strings and Brass in the Winery was born. This gives people a chance to come along and taste great food and wine and listen to live music. We're playing a totally different array of music every year. This year we've got a tribute to George Gershwin and some Piazzolla. Paul is a, is a showman and a, and a brilliant musician. I mean, he's played, he's chief trumpet for Sydney Symphony Orchestra and he loves music, he loves classical music and more importantly, he loves wine. He's been a great ambassador for the hunter generally and so, yeah, it's a, it's a perfect match. It's such a unique atmosphere here to be so close to the orchestra. You get a, a, such a special natural feel of the music. Paul makes it special as well because um, apart from the music itself, he stands up and uh, gives an introduction to every piece and makes everybody feel so comfortable as if they're his friends. So it's just a great experience of, of all of that and friendship and connection with the music, the wine, the food, it's pretty hard to beat. Yeah. We have a different menu every year. We have a different menu of food as well as music. And there's a different menu of wines. People love coming to the Hunter for wine tasting. And this is something different apart from just going out for dinner, going out for lunch and tasting wine. There's something here that they can actually really uh, grab hold of. This piece of land here in the Hunter Valley is idyllic for an event such as this. It's elevated, you walk out of the tasting area, you have this gorgeous view of the rest of the valley, the Broken Back Range, a winery setting for a concert, surrounded by all the barrels, beautiful food, beautiful wine, and live music. This here is the most idyllic, beautiful chamber music setting. It's got a cement floor surrounded by wood. It's ideal. Allendale wines are very close to my heart. The variety of their wines and the consistency that's one of the reasons why I love coming back. It's, it's a joy to come back every year. We're looking to keep it fresh and lively for us and it's about, you know, creating those connections with people and um, what do we say, love marks, you know, it's about getting people to feel good about the winery and feeling part of the, of the winery, part of the family of the winery, meeting the staff, yeah, actually sharing the wines in the winery. It's a it's a terrific event for people to, you know, feel close to to the label.